Alright guys, um, I just wanted to uh, discuss a few things with you, oh, stop the video, um, I'm showing this kit for the, the grounds of it has to be changed, there is no, you know, way around it, this kit has to be changed, uh, my internet crapped out on me, um, about halfway through this game. But you want me to tell you the score halfway through this game? 103 and 3. 103 kills at the halfway point of a domination. I could easily break, you know, 150 kills. No sweat with this fucking kit. This kit, what this kit consists of is. One man army, a assault rifle with a new tube. I'm used. I'm using the F2000 because I still got unlocks to do with it. Um, and whatever the fuck third perk you want, I'm using scrambler just to be that much more annoying. It's that easy. What you do is you shoot two new tubes, you throw your claymore down, and you reload, shoot two new tubes, throw a claymore down, reload, shoot two new tubes, throw a claymore down, reload. These are danger close claymores. Once you get five kills, which is easy because you can spam, I mean, you don't even got to know if somebody's there. It's like, floop, floop, reload, floop, floop, reload. You can, and once you get five kills, you get a, you know, Chuck Norris enhanced predator missile. Danger close increases the blast radius of your uh, explosives. And it also increases the splash damage. Well, well, well that's blast radius. It keep, increases the damage and, and the splash damage of explosives. So it does it by 1.4, the same as stopping power. So you pretty much, once you get five kills, your Predator Missile is guaranteed a Harrier. Harrier generally does what it does. It gets, it gets a, a, a very super-powered you know, airstrike, and then it has the Harrier bullets, which are increased as well so they pretty much just got to hit somebody um, but the Harry bullets don't change that much and then you get a Chuck Norris enhanced chopper gunner which you can see right here I'm just spamming this shit they're spawn trapped they can't even shoot me down at this point because the blast radius the, the chopper gunner does so much damage and the blast radius is so high on a uh, it's like, like, like I was shooting at the tail of the plane I was still hitting them over there after that there's nothing they can do, dude. I mean, yeah, you, they can fight and sit down, but like you can see, there's cold-blooded people there. But the flash damage is just getting them because it has so it's so big and large. Like right here, I'm just trying to kill myself. I don't really care. I, they help help me out. Oh, look, I get to build my kill streaks up again. This has to be changed. This is a game-breaking kit. It's more than Commando. It's the worst kit on the game. I'm using it solely on the fact I need to show this kit. People crying about, oh, you're no good. You're no good. Dude, you can break 200 kills with this kit. This, I, I ran into, when I said I hate Modern Warfare 2, I ran into seven people using this exact kit, but they used it with the farmers. Seven. There's no way anybody will survive it. Did you see that Claymore? That's it got two kills. It blew the guy halfway across the room. They need to lower the, the, the. They need to make it so one man army can only change you one time. They need to make uh, it not reload grenades. That will fix this kit. Danger close needs to either only increase the blast radius and not increase the damage. Uh, because the. The, the explosives are pretty balanced if the damage isn't increased. Just make the uh, danger close, just increase the radius, and I'll make the kill zone a little bigger. But increasing the damage on top of it is just retarded because you get to spam it. This has to be fixed. This is worse than the models. This is just utter bullshit, dude. This one man army is broken as fuck. Like right here, I'm on my second chopper gunner. And uh, what can they do? The spawning system is fucked up in this game. This adds insult to injury. Look at it. I don't care how good of a player you are. You're not getting out of this. I don't even have to aim. I, I'm just holding it down. 
This is why I was mad at Modern Warfare 2. But I currently have to play this game. I seriously do because it is the flavor of the year. I'll probably have to play this game the entire freaking year. And this needs to be fixed. The kill streaks need to be fixed. There needs to be mercenary game modes. I'm doing this by myself. I just happen to get on a good team. But I, I played I played about four or five games with this kit before I, I ran into this game. And every one of them were blowouts. I'm talking about because I was jumping from team to team. I was on the other team last game and I went 68 and 4. I didn't, well, I think it was 68 and 7, I'm sorry. I didn't get, only got one chopper gunner. But the fact is, this kit pretty much guarantees chopper gunner. What are they going to, how, how can you defend against this? Blast shield will not work. Blast shield will just make, just make it like a, uh, a regular new tube with a big ass radius. And a regular new tube can still kill you with blast shield. It doesn't cancel it 100% out. Well, I'm sorry. Blast shield will cancel out the extra damage it does, but then it's just like a regular new tube hitting you. Will not help. And even if you decide to wear blast shield because you're the best player in the game, your teammate ain't going to have it on, and it's probably going to still get you and him. So it really won't matter. Just have a little icon pop up on the guy's screen. This kit needs to be broken, and... I'm about to go to El Presidor or something, out and, and you know, Infinity War needs to needs to give up, give everybody who bought this fucking game an apology. I think this game was overhyped, and it does not live up to its hype whatsoever. I mean, don't get me wrong; it's a fun game when at times and stuff. But like, I wasn't even having fun. It, it, it's a good game, but it needs fixing. That they, they, they threw shit in this game, and they didn't even. Think about the consequences of it. All right, let's give them a perk where they can recharge their grenade launchers. Why couldn't I have been in that room and been like, "Can I raise my hand?" What happens when they start spamming this shit and the guns are worthless? Well, they'll never spam that shit. They'll never do that. Seriously, when you put something in a video game, you got to think about how bad it can be abused. And this is retarded. Anybody who downed Treyarch for having an MP40 jug, this is worse. Seriously, I don't know if y'all how many people have come up against this. This isn't a real popular kit just yet. But, what? look at it, dude. Retarded. Not even trying, just decimating people because the kit kills them yourself. I know I'm going to see thousands of this kit after I release this video because everybody's going to go out and try it. And, and uh, somebody's going to be like, well, I'm, I created that kit or so on and so forth. I don't care. This has to change. The only way things change is people have to bitch about them. If nobody bitches, nothing happens. If, every th if, if the water stays calm, nobody complains about where it leads to. This has to change. It's your boy, Wings of Redemption, signing out.